happened? I don't know. All of a sudden, his lunaglyph burst, and he went on a rampage. What are we going to do? Edward? Edward, your hand! Give me your hand! Edward! No! He's gone! Too late? He can still be saved. Um, but enough of that! We'll save him! Okay. There! Yeah! Bullseye! All right, now we have to get him down. This might hurt. Could this be... Edward's past? How fare you? Fine! Very good. You risked your life to save me! Thank you! I did what I had to do. Please, at least tell me your name. Run. This place is dangerous. Please wait! Take... take me with you! You saved my life. 
Now I must offer mine in return. It's Sigmund. What? You asked my name. And I'm Edward. Please, allow me to serve you. No, he'll never die. He's the Liberator. He's Sigmund. It's not possible. He cannot be killed. Never. Edward. Why? Why is it that everyone can just accept his death? He's gone. He's left us. What should I do now? What can I do? Damn it! Edward! Damn it! Lord Sigmund! Stand up! Who is it? Stand up, Edward! Come on! Capel. I... I... Edward, are you in any pain? No, you should lie still. Why didn't you kill me? What are you talking about? Everyone was trying to... I remember to... how I behaved in that form. I was a vicious monster. I should have been killed. Why didn't you kill me? Um, well, because there was no need to kill you. What? We had a way of curing you, and so we made our best effort to help you. It was an easy choice. Everyone has a role to play. And it is your duty to make your best effort to fulfill that role. Make your best effort? Huh? You simply did your duty. I was saved as a result. That's all that happened. Um, if I said something that offended you, I'm sorry. You're always apologizing to everyone. Am I? <laughs> I've been trying too hard. Both physically and mentally. What are you two babbling about? Everyone, thank you. And I'm sorry for what happened. Well, it's about time you calmed down. Thanks a lot. Capel? Hmm? Thank you. Thank me later, Ed.
Everyone. I have something I must tell you. Why so formal? I think... I think that I should leave the Force. What? So you're going to go back to the old selfish Ed again, now that you're well? No, no. I'm afraid this might happen again. So it's best that we go our separate ways. Because of your Luna Glyph? You are not the only one. It can happen to any of us. But... I no longer feel like using my Luna Glyph anymore. I will only serve to slow you down. Without a glyph, I'm nothing more than a liability. That's not true. It is. And you won't get far with me holding you back. If unblessed were here, I know what they'd say. Let those with lunaglyphs fight. They are able. We don't belong on the battlefield. Let only those worthy of the battle join it. What's wrong with the glyphless? Are you saying it's such a bad thing to be without one? What's gotten into you? Listen to me. You can live just fine without a lunaglyph. What's wrong, Capel? Yeah, well... Well, I don't have a lunaglyph! What are you saying? What I'm saying is... that I'm an unblessed! You're... an unblessed? Not having a lunaglyph makes you a useless burden. Then it looks like I'd be the first to go. Capel. Hey, why the sad face? Well. Do you really think that I'm so narrow-minded that I'd get upset over something like a Luna Glyph? But you look kind of... angry, so... I am angry! I knew it. Why didn't you tell me? Tell you? Why didn't you share your most important secret with me? Why'd you hide it? You've got this all backwards. First, you tell me. Then you tell the others. You're angry... about that? Well, it's very important! Not having a lunaglyph. Why don't you get it? I don't care about that! I, uh... From now on, you need to be more open with me. About everything. Okay? Thanks. Get in here now! You have something to say, don't you? Ed. Come on, speak up. Sorry about earlier. Why are you apologizing? Because... Give me a chance to apologize too. All I wanted was to be perfect. But I should have known that I could never be perfect while weighed down with thoughts like that. I might make the same mistake again, but it would be an honor to fight alongside you. Please! No way! Well, I always run from trouble. <laughs> no more running away for you! Ow, I'm just joking! I'm sorry! <laughs> awfully happy. Huh? Do I look weird? No, not at all. <laughs> Mind if I sit next to you? Aya told me everything. Hmm? Lunaglyphs? Uh... <laughs> So, we're the same, aren't we? Yeah, we are. <laughs> the 
This makes me so happy. I've always wanted it to be like this. Really? I feel a lot closer to you now. I might have ended up keeping it hidden if it weren't for Ed. You kept this to yourself? Yeah. You should have trusted your friends. I'm uh, not very good at trusting. Well, why don't you practice? Huh? Practice with me. What, what, what does that have to do with trust? That is definitely something else. Are you sure? Well, I did promise I'd do anything for you. Wait, so that's what you really meant? For you. Capel, I like you. Uh, eh. And what about you? Well, I... Sorry for interrupting you two. <laughs> Hello, I, uh, it's a n n n nice day today, huh? You look like you're having fun. Yes, we are. Aren't we, Capel? What? Oh, yes. Kind of. <laughs> Excuse me while I intrude on your special moment, but I need to borrow Capel for a bit. I am very sorry. Hey, that hurts. You don't have to drag me all over. Just keep your mouth shut. You're absolutely useless around women. Hey, leader. Tell us where to go. First, to Halgita.